program for you this morning to um, celebrate a wonderful development for San Benito for this area of the valley. Yes, it was already on the books, so I would be remiss if I didn't recognize uh, former Mayor Joe Hernandez. It started with in his administration, and he wrestled with it for a year, and then I he passed the baton on to me, and I took it over, and I've been wrestling with it for a year, negotiating it, and um, uh, thank you, Devin and Britt. You taught me how to negotiate and how to negotiate well, let me tell you. It's uh, something else. And thank you, commissioners. They helped me also with the negotiations. And we're to this point a year later, it took us two years, and we're to this point to unveil what we think will be an anchor for all this property here in San Benito, an anchor that will hopefully bring other businesses and more jobs and prosperity and growth to San Benito. One part of it is four stories and it will be completed in 2016. Uh, yeah, construction will begin. It will have a resort quality swimming pool and the outdoor swimming pool will be one of the best and largest pools in the area. It will be designed to accommodate events that may choose to rent the space outside for events or gathering. So you probably have guessed it by now. What we are unveiling is a four-story hotel, the Fairfield Inn and in Suites by Marriott, which is a national brand and it will have approximately 90 to 110 rooms. Which will create a nice... Will create, we have hotels in our city, but we don't have one this size or of this magnitude. But what Victor's going to announce, we don't have at all. Victor? Well, it took us two years, but here we are. I was just commenting to some of the board members that uh, reality is here. It finally hit the ground. The second component, as it's being wrestled with Salomon over here. Salomon Blanco, Cinco de Mayo, instead of Anna White. The second component is a conference center. Uh, the San Benito. Of course, the construction is only six million to construct, so don't worry about it. <laughs> right, Devin? Uh, there will be multiple meeting space options. The center will accommodate smaller groups needing high quality meeting rooms and space. It will also have an outdoor rental space, amenities, unlike any other similar hotels. This hotel and conference center will have extra outside venue amenities such as an attached courtyard that will enable events to combine inside inside and outside rental space. So this is something that is not here right now. This is something that's going to be new to this area. And of course, we want to be able to draw people into San Benito. This is only the, the anchor, the beginning. So we hope that uh, this project will bring in other projects and we know it's going to happen. We have a lot of faith, right Father? I told myself this time coming down, I wasn't going to fly. I was going to drive. That way, I'd make darn sure I got here on time because I wasn't going to miss this meeting. It didn't dawn on me when I left Wichita that this was almost a thousand mile drive. I'll never do it again. The upcoming San Benito Hotel and Conference Center, Fairfield Inn and Suites, by Marriott. Thank you and God bless you. <laughs>